a mathematician and today I'm going to tell you how to convert kPa to inches of mercury. So the conversion you need to know is that one kPa is approximately 0.2953 inches of mercury. So I'm going to estimate this a little bit more to make it easier for our conversions and we'll say that one kPa is approximately 0.3 inches of mercury. So the first step to conversion is knowing what the conversion formula is and then setting up a proportion to solve for whatever it might be. So if I know that one kPa is three inches, I'm going to set up 0.3 inches. I'm going to set up a ratio that I can use for all of my conversions, one kPa over 0.3 inches. And now depending on what the other piece of information is that I'm given, I can convert using a proportion. So let's say I'm told that I have five kPa's and I want to know how many inches of mercury is that when I don't know what something is I give it a variable and now I have a proportion all I have to do is cross multiply so I'm going to multiply 0.3 times 5 and I get 0.15 and I multiply 1 times x and I just get 1x so that means that in 5 kPa there would be 0.15 inches of mercury so the conversion you need to know is 1 kPa is approximately 3 inches of mercury and then just set up your proportion and solve. My name is Maria and I just showed you how to convert kPa's to, inch to inches of mercury.